Girl. Really? Now, we got some updates on this Dwight Howard situation. And if y'all didn't watch my last video, y'all need to check that out before you watch this one, okay? Because we have some updates on that accuser and the text messages and stuff like that. But first, we got to get to another man who is coming out and saying he had some past dealings with Dwight Howard too. Now, this guy's actually breaking an NDA to put this information out there, okay? So he can basically face legal ramifications just speaking on his past relationship with Dwight Howard. But he had a lot to say. Lock in, like the video, and subscribe. So this individual said, respectfully, I'll never speak on this situation again because it has nothing to do with me. I feel sympathy for the new victim and hope he receives justice. I believe every word. The only reason I decided to break my agreement and laugh publicly today is because after all of these years and assumptions that I lied, after all these blogs tried to ruin my name and cover up for an abuse, it finally comes out that he goes to sex parties and preys on younger men, which was originally why he threatened, forced, and tried to intimidate me into signing a NDA, which made me to speak out in 2018. It was never about his sexuality, yet I got dragged for speaking on threats I received about unwarranted information i found out from kitty kitty okay kitty is being brought up again remember this accuser with the text messages is saying that they were forced to have a threesome with dwight and kitty so this person knows kitty too who was also harassing me in 2018 so i guess Dwight has a strong bond with Kitty and Kitty don't like none of the other men that Dwight be messing with. OK, and if y'all don't know, Kitty is a man, too. OK, just just putting it out there. OK. Come to find out, Kitty was in attendance at this very sex party in 2021 where the new victim had their situation. God said, be silent vengeance is mine okay now we keep hearing about kitty so i i guess kitty is his main thing his, his you know the main guy he mess with and he likes to bring other guys into the situation for him and kitty okay now let's get to the updates about the current case okay okay so dwight howard is claiming this gentleman harper is only kicking up all of this dust because he's upset that Dwight Howard blocked him on Instagram. And here's the direct quote. Dwight claims he later blocked Harper on Instagram, and that's when things went left. Court documents show Dwight alleged that Harper confronted him with two options, pay up or have your reputation ruined with a fabricated story. So he's claiming that Harper already told him if he don't give him no money, he going to make up these lies on him, okay? We got some more. Hold on. And see, and see, 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 I saved this for last because this is going to bring it all together. Now, both of these guys who apparently had past dealings with Dwight Howard, who we talked about in this video, both mention kitty and dwight howard is bringing kitty to the courtroom to be a witness to prove that he is innocent and didn't do nothing to harper okay so kenny no not kenny kitty kitty is coming to court it would be funny if kitty's real name was kenny though <laughs> okay <laughs> but kitty is coming to court and Kitty is going to fight for Dwight Howard, okay? So that's all we got for right now.
I'm going to try to keep y'all updated with this. But what do y'all think so far? Make sure y'all like the video and subscribe. I will see y'all next time. Peace.